Goes Crazy by Tyler Towers. <laughs> Once there were two kids, Pedro and Humphrey. They are best friends and live next to each other. But, Pe but Pedro has had one secret he had never told Humphrey. Just an, any emerald, an orange emerald, passed down to him by his great, 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 great uncle Bob. <laughs> <laughs> One day, Humphrey happened to read about the orange emerald. He read in a book that there is that only that there is only one that exists in the entire world. stopping to figure out where they were, Terrence suddenly got hit by a robo bird. This knocks the gem from Terrence's beak and Pedro caught the precious gem. Believe it didn't break. The boys noticed that the robo bird had come from a time portal just a block away from where they were. Chapter 6, Dr. Wacky. <laughs> the boys and Terrence walked into the portal, curious. There was a strange scientist in a small room in the future. It works! It works! My robot bird! It works! He exclaimed. Who are you? asked Humphrey. Me? asked the scientist. Humphrey nodded. I am Dr. Wacky, and why did you come here? <laughs> As Dr. Wacky. We are chasing this bird who stole my super rare orange emerald, said Pedro. Orange emerald? The world famous super rare orange emerald, is Dr. Wacky. Of course, answered Pedro. Why, that's not the world famous super rare orange emerald that my robo bird knocked out of the blackbird's beak. Anyone can see that the, that is a simple rock painted orange. Pedro and Humphrey both shouted, What? As <coughs> Karen squawked, Squawk! Chapter 7, The Happy Ending. So Pedro and Humphrey said their goodbyes and walked out of the portal. Then, hum then Humphrey went home and said goodbye to Pedro. Pedro tried to, to get the bird to say its name. It squawked out, Terrence. <laughs> when Pedro, Pedro went inside and begged his mom to keep Terrence as a pet. He told her that because of Terrence, he had discovered that the gem was a fake. It was just a PT 